Hello, and welcome to our second episode of the fried and pickled fig. Today on the menu, mango turmeric cupcakes that are raw, vegan, and grain free. Hmm, sounds delicious. They are, Steve. We're gonna start with the bottom layer. It's all gonna go right here in this food processor. One take, Steve, we can't mess it up. Half a cup of raw almonds. Voila. Half a cup of sunflower seeds, raw again. Easy peasy. Six medjool dates. Careful to make sure they're pitted, otherwise your cupcake's gonna be a little too crunchy. Gotcha. One tablespoon of coconut oil. All right. Quarter teaspoon true cinnamon and a quarter teaspoon of Himalayan pink salt. Mm, a nice. great source of electrolytes, by the way. Perfect. All right, that's all there is to it. We're gonna no. pop the lid on and we're gonna puree it up. I can do that. The mixture is nicely pureed here. So, Steve, I'm gonna get you to divide it evenly between eight cupcake molds. Well, it's pretty firm. This is some serious pressure. We're going to take these cupcake molds and set them aside. Now for our top layer, back to our food processor and a small melting pot. We're gonna start with taking one cup of coconut manna, which is really the whole coconut puree, unlike coconut oil, which is just the fat. Throw that guy in. Two tablespoons of coconut oil. Did you wash your hands? And two tablespoons of dark maple syrup. Oh, Mila, what's that right behind you there? That was like three quarters of a tablespoon oh, there, Steve. Oh. Throw a little bit more in there, okay? Okay. All right. All right. Oh, good, oh! <laughs> this is gonna be sweet. This lovely mixture goes onto the stove. We're just gonna melt it, set it aside, while we move on. Steve's working on the final stage here. Going to squeeze the juice out of one lime. Two teaspoons of fresh turmeric a fantastic anti-inflammatory and antioxidant. Great, one tablespoon of fresh ginger. Chop one large mango. Great to incorporate a mango, they're delicious this time of year. Quarter teaspoon of cinnamon and a half a teaspoon of the pink Himalayan salt, all thrown together into our food processor. Puree it up until smooth. This vibrant mixture now gets stirred into. That stuff. Take this beautiful stovetop mixture and create our top layer. Oh, easy peasy. These guys need to set. We'll pop them in the freezer. Won't take long at all. Voila. Wow, that's a heck of a freezer. Yeah, look at them. They're beautiful. Let's try one, Steve. So how cool is that? Throwing something together so simple, so delicious, and so quickly. Mm. Thanks mm. for following us. We'll see you next month.